take you to a jamming Jamaican party, man. It's next on News 12 Long Island as local as local news gets. Thank Good you morning, very much. Heather. Thank you. We're jamming. We're jamming. We'd be jamming <laughs> at Whale's Tale, right? That's right. You know, it's a great place to go, and that's where Holly Hare is this morning, and she's cooking up something special for us. What do you have? Well, I'm not exactly cooking. DJ Chef will be cooking for us. We're at the Jammin' Jamaican Reggae Party here at the Whale's Tale in Long Beach, and you're going to be cooking up some Jammin' Jamaican banana bread? Yeah, banana bread with uh, vanilla ice cream we have. Um, I have some of the ingredients here. We have the butter and the margarine already whipped. Uh, we have the brown sugar, bananas, flour, already in this bowl. We're going to break the eggs, which is the next step, into this bowl. The cooking over here, we've got the eggs being whipped up. What else uh, goes into this recipe? Well, I'm going to put a special twist on the uh, recipe you have there. We're going to add a little splash of rum because we're feeling a little extra festive this morning. Um, we're going to mix this mixture into the bowl with the eggs. Oh, that for you? Oh, thanks for the help. <laughs> Always nice to have the rubber spatula at this point. And we're running out of time, so we're going to show you the finished product right over here. And you've got some uh, squiggly stuff on top of that. What's that yeah, for your presentation um, You can use here? your favorite sauce with this. I have caramel, white chocolate sauce, chocolate sauce. And um, you get this on the menu here at the Whale's Tale in Long Beach. All right, that's excellent. And uh, we'll have to taste a little bit of that, a little bit of that later. That it looks, looks great. delicious. Mm -hmm. I'm ready. I'm hungry. <laughs> now, if you want any of these recipes for all these great dishes that you've seen with DJ Chef, well, forget about it. We're going to keep them secret. <laughs> no, 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 no. No. Log on to our website, news12.com, and follow the numbers and links page. <laughs> True. Ahead on News 12 Long Island's Morning Edition, parents, it's almost time to send your kids back to school. That's right. We're going to help you get organized next on News 12 Long Island, as local as local news gets. We're at the Jam and Jamaican party at the Whale's Tale in Long Beach, and coconut shrimp is on the menu this morning. Hey. I'm Holly here at the Whale's Tale in Long Beach, where DJ Chef is going to show us how to make this into that. Are you hungry? I am, yes. I saw some shrimp that Holly oh, Hare had over that. at the Whale's Tail. Yeah, it was just driving us crazy, yeah. Holly. How you doing? <laughs> Great. It's never too early for shrimp at the Whale's Tail in Long Beach Jam and Jamaican Reggae Party with DJ Chef. And we're making coconut shrimp. Tell me what you're doing right over here with the shrimp. Right, we have our shrimp in a flour and water mixture. Mm -hmm. um, actually, it's flour and heavy cream. Okay. Just a little dredge. And I'm going to add a little bit of the seafood flavor. Is it a little seasoning? It's a little old bay, pepper, and lemon peel. Are the tails on the shrimp, or are they, uh, you yeah, already we'll stripped them? Yeah, leave the tails on. It makes for a nice presentation. Okay. And, and then what do you do? just dredge it in the coconut. The coconut sticks to it. You want to pack it on a little bit. Then we bake in the oven for about 20 minutes at 350 degrees. And is that just plain coconut in there? Yeah, it's uh, sweetened coconut, so it has a little sweetness to it. And you said you bake it, because I've made this before, but I've fried it, and baking seems like it'd be a lot better for you. Yeah, well, I got a lot of requests, you know, to kind of find a healthy solution to the fried foods, and um, I found when you bake it, you can come and get it nice and crispy, just the way like you would fry it. Okay. So, um, here so we're going to bake, bake it 350 degrees, and I came up with a presentation. I put it on the skewers, mm -hmm. I have a little pineapple nice. that goes our reggae theme, um, and I garnish with a little pineapple. What's this over Mango here? Because I know you sometimes get a little sweet with this type of coconut. So this is something to um, make yeah, that, it less sweet? That's a lemon curly, a lemon curry dipping sauce, um, which has a kind of a sweet hot thing going on. Excellent. So yeah, we're going to have to absolutely. try some of this in uh, just a moment. And too bad you at the studio can't try it with us. Oh, uh, you better bring some back. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking about it if there's any left. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right, Elizabeth, well, start if you want these recipes on the great dishes that you saw, then you can log on to our website, news12.com, and click onto the numbers and links section. All right, ahead for you here on News 12 Long Island's Morning Edition. Parents, almost time to send the kids back to school. Well, we are going to help you get organized. It's next on News 12 Long Island, as local as local news gets. That looks really delicious. I'm Holly Hare at the Whale's Tale in Long Beach. We're here with DJ Chef at the Jam and Jamaican Party, and he's going to show us how to make some ragamuffin salmon salad. Plus, we're living it up in Long Beach at the Jamaican Reggae Party, next on News 12 Long Island.
Drew, do you like shrimp? I love shrimp. Me too. Mm -hmm. And I think Holly Hare is making it a little bit spicy at a jam and Jamaican party at the Whale Show in Long Beach. How is it, Holly? It's great. And actually, I got to show you over here. There's only one shrimp left. I don't know what me? happened. Is it for me? <laughs> uh, yeah, sure. I'll bring it back for you. It'll right. be great. <laughs> We are at the Whale's Tale. We're the Jam and Jamaican party with DJ Chef. And right now, we're actually making some other seafood, a salmon salad. What goes into this? Yeah, this is the ragamuffin salmon salad, where we're going to sear the salmon. And we're going to get a little crazy. We're going to flame it up with a little rum. All right. Woo. Now, we're not <laughs> cooking unless we have some fire. And uh, what do we say? Stop, drop, and roll? Yeah, and don't try this at home, I think. That's right. Don't try this at home. So we have the salmon salad, we clean up the salmon, and we have a nice mango papaya vinaigrette that we um, toss the, the dressing with and a mango salsa to top it off. How long does that salmon have to cook? Does it have to be cooked all the way through or can it be a little raw in the middle? Um, you, can, you can eat it a little raw in the middle. Uh, most people like it, you know, a little pink, but uh, you can cook it through it too if, uh, you know, you like it that way. And you are the executive chef here at the Whale's Tale, so you have all sorts of dishes like this or better than this or... Actually, we're launching a new menu this weekend. Um, it's going to be like a China House seafood theme mm -hmm. that we're very excited about. And um, I invite you all to come down and check it out. It's going to be a lot of fun. Okay. We also want to tell you what we made earlier today, which is the coconut shrimp over here, which there is only one left. Don't, like I said, don't know what happened to that. We've got the banana bread with ice cream. What's the secret of uh, not melting ice cream on TV? Well, this is actually Crisco. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Which, um, you know, we use in baking, but uh, it doesn't melt. So it looks pretty. And the salmon salad, so that's, that's right. great. And, and the salad. what else goes in that garnish over there? You got pineapple and a uh, little mango. fruit chips. We have toasted peanuts in there, mescaline lettuce, and uh, mango salsa. All right, so uh, maybe if you're lucky, we'll bring you back a shrimp if it lasts for the next few minutes, Elizabeth. And Drew. And you nobody got the aroma must be wonderful. Oh, it, looks, you know? it looks oh. delicious. And if you want the recipes for all those great dishes that you just saw, you can log on to our website, news12.com. Does everyone want to come and eat now? Everyone. All right. Thanks for being with us today. And enjoy your Monday, everybody. Should be a very nice day. I can't wait to enjoy it. Get out there. Yeah. Sunshine. Make it safe, everybody. Thanks for joining us. There's more news straight ahead.